The winds get stronger. We start to bring in some colder air. Not going to be, as we talk about, brutally cold, but certainly we are going to cool things down once we head into later tomorrow. And then again on your Thursday. There goes the front. This is all sponsored by the mattress firm. Uh, the winds first, then the cooler air arrives in here tomorrow night and into your Thursday. Here's the setup for the winds. You folks on the east-northeast side of town, look at that. Uh, you're going to be looking at those gusts at about 55 miles per hour. Likely to see some reduced visibility with some of that blowing dust and sand. That'll start to occur tomorrow afternoon. Now the winds early in the morning hours should be okay. If you're going to be out in about 6, 7, 8 o'clock in the morning. But they're going to gradually build as we make our way into the afternoon hours. Here's what we're talking about with the winds. You'll see the winds sustain southwesterly at 25 to 35, gusts of 55. The time frame, 1 o'clock to 5 o'clock. That's going to be that area where the winds will hit 55. Before 1 o'clock and after 5 o'clock, it'll still be windy, just not quite hitting 55 miles per hour. And of course, you folks on the east, northeast sides of town will get the brunt of it. Thank goodness temperatures have been warm today with some of the winds. We've been hanging out in the mid upper 70s all across town. We have 40s and 50s right now up in the Sacramento Mountains. And what we are looking at as far as our latest feature track computer model, clear skies the rest of tonight. Then as we watch tomorrow, you'll notice from the west to the east, you'll start to see the clouds move in. You'll start to see some of the blowing dust and sand out to the west. that will gradually make its way to the east. But notice where we could pick up some light rain. This is not going to be a big rainmaker. It's going to hit us uh, very quick and be out of here uh, very quickly. So you may see a drop or two on your windshield, maybe a few sprinkles. I think that's about it. It doesn't look like we can see much of measurable rainfall. And snowfall, we could be tracking light snow up in the higher elevations, up in the Gila, Sacramento Mountains, but this is not, again, going to be a big snow event. The clouds will hang around for Thursday. Then we're going to clear things out for Friday and the upcoming weekend. Right now, the weekend looks good. You do have any outdoor plans. Overnight, temperatures going to be in the 40s. High temperatures for tomorrow will be in the 60s. Out ahead of the front, the front comes through a little bit earlier tomorrow. We won't be able to make it quite into the upper 60s and low 70s, but if it gets delayed just a bit, it'll be another fairly warm day. You folks in Donianna County, overnight low is going to be in the 30s and 40s. And your high temps tomorrow, places like La Union at 66, La Mesa at 64 degrees. Here's your forecast, 46 will be the overnight low, sunset time at 552, sunrise tomorrow, 647, but becoming very windy with those southwesterly winds. Las Cruces temperatures down to 40 for you, and your high temp will make it up to 65. Here comes the next several days. So we go down to 42 Thursday morning. The winds will be up early Thursday, 55. So we'll be colder day behind that front. Look at Friday morning, 31. Then we'll be about 58 degrees. We're on the upswing after Thursday because the weekend looks good. Sunshine, temperature's going to be in the upper 60s. Another windmaker, although the wind's not quite as strong by next Monday and Tuesday.